So we made it up to Second Lake. Look at this. Jesus Christ. Look at my face. Yeah. What's up? This is Richie and Jamie from the Where We Wild YouTube channel, and I'm grounded this weekend. I uh, kind of did something to my back, and uh, I wanted to go fishing this weekend, but uh, I'm kind of grounded. So I'm just uh, kind of chilling this weekend, and I thought it might be fun to rewatch the very first Where We Wild video we ever made yeah. um, when we went and uh, hiked Big Pine Lakes up in the Sierras. That was insane. That was an amazing trip. I mean, we're, just to we're pick a that, nuts. yeah, <laughs> to pick that for our first video, that was actually like a whole road trip where we went yeah. to, uh, what was that place, Rock Creek mm -hmm. first, and uh, you know, we, we planned to drive all the way up to Oregon, I think, or something like that, or, and we never even Seattle. got out of California. Yeah. Right? We yeah. went and uh, didn't even make it out of Cali. Yep. But so yeah, we figured we'd watch that together. We ha it's going to be three years, I think, in July. Yep. Since our very first uh, YouTube video. It's crazy. Yeah. So I don't know. We're going to watch it and uh, just kind of, you know, remember. We haven't seen. When's the last time you saw this? I can't even tell you. At least a year ago at this point. I don't even remember. But it should be interesting. Yeah, but we thought maybe this could be a cool idea, like where we rewatch some of our favorite videos every once in a while and just kind of give like uh, a director's commentary. Is yeah, that basically like a, what it would be called? Creator's like commentary? Behind the scenes. Commentary, yeah, some behind the scenes stuff. Yeah. Um, yeah, this should be interesting. Let's get into it. Hiking Big Pine Lakes Trail, the very first Where We Wild video ever. Let's see what happens. I am dying. <laughs> It's a, it is a serious, serious climb up, man. My traps are killing me and shoulders from my pack. I'm in some pain, but I'm alive. How are, how are you? Doing good. My shoulders are on fire. Yeah, I can't move my trap. I need Mr. Miyagi. <laughs> Seriously. Karate Kid. Mr. Miyagi. Oh, you feel it? That is yeah. bad. All right, I'm diving in this lake when I get there. I don't care how cold oh, it is. Oh, it's gonna be amazing. I don't care. Let's go. Still alive. <laughs> so the very first video we ever did, I put that little intro and then went into that. That place was nice. 7,500 feet. Yeah, this is all iPhone footage. We didn't have GoPros yet. No. I'm gonna wow. pause, it, pause it right there. What number campsite? What, wait, what was the 18. name? Upper Sage Upper Flat? Upper Sage Flat. And that site number 18. Site number 18. It was right on that river. Right on the river. That the was site nice. was like pretty big. Yeah, it was cool. But I remember we had a little tough time with that new tent. Yeah, because yeah. the tent was so big. Yeah. But man, that was really, really Do pretty. Do you remember the deer like across the river? Uh, coming down to drink from oh, it. Oh, yeah. so beautiful. Yeah, it was cool. I tried to fish in there, didn't I, for a minute or yeah. no? I don't remember if I had gear or not. Oh, I did, I did, I tried. So I decided to cook a little chicken tonight, corn on the cob, a little vegetable that packet, was that was onions, so good. mushrooms, that would be. I remember we, we went down to that food store next to the Kmart, right? Mm -hmm. When we when we bought the new tent. Yes. And we just like Tried to get know, anything like we could. That was or... that was really good. That was really that came good. out like really really good. Yeah. We'll get to the point uh, talking about the tent when we get there. I guess. So, yeah. Scenery. So it's Monday, July twenty second, five forty five in the morning. We've got some water boiling here. Try to get some coffee. Just got that tent last night because the first tent we had was too small and I'm 6'3", so it was a nightmare. So I had to find a Kmart. I'm, we're in the middle of nowhere, so there's no Walmart. There's a Kmart. And uh, so I got that tent. It was like 80 bucks, something like that, but it was pretty sweet so far. Christ, do I look younger? Just from three years ago? Am well, I like aging horribly? No, I, well, I Jesus, do. I always have those friggin' zits on the side of my head from sweating my butt off all the time. Yeah. There, are those like birthmarks or are they just zits from wearing hats and sweating? Mm, yeah. 
That's so crazy. All right. So anyway, before we got to this place, <laughs> we camped at a place called Rock Creek, mm -hmm. right? And we had a four man tent and it, I couldn't stretch out in it, man. No. I, I could not fully extend my legs. And so I ended up sleeping in the car that night and the mosquitoes up there were so horrific. Mm -hmm. It was crazy. It was, did you ever see Jumanji where they're like the monster mosquitoes are breaking through the windshield? That's what it felt like. Like they were literally hitting the glass, like trying to get at me. I think I have a video on my cell phone of it. You probably do. It, it was insane. So I got like no sleep. That place was beautiful, but my God. And we didn't figure out using sage yet. Mm -mm. We didn't have any of that then. We were still like on bug spray and I was just getting whacked. And I just couldn't take it anymore, man. I felt so claustrophobic. So the next day before we came up to this place, um, we found a Kmart and we bought this new tent that's like we still use to this day. Yeah, it's Three great. years later, it's like a six man tent. It was like 88 bucks or something, something if like I remember that. it like yeah. that. But it was just so weird, man, that it was a Kmart. I was the just like, Kmart wow. The last Kmart on earth, first of all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I haven't seen a Kmart in like so long. Yeah. But, but yeah, that was crazy, man. And so. we're so lucky that there was even anything nearby because we had, we camped the one night and then the next night was the night before this huge hike that mm -hmm. we planned on camping again. And he was like, I'm not going to make it. Like we have such a sleep. long hike and it, like a really strenuous day ahead of us. There's no way I can sleep in this tent or in the car again. Yeah, that was a nightmare. So thank God we found. That's probably summer. why I have back problems right now. <laughs> Just from, from that pulling one Pulling stuff like that, yeah. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, so that was, that was the first night we slept in that tent, right? Yeah. And it wasn't so bad. I remember it was really nice here in that river, but I also remember it getting a little damp inside the tent from yeah. all the water uh, being, being by so the close, river, yeah. yeah, but it was way nicer. Oh yeah, way nicer. We still use it to this day. Mm -hmm. But uh, we're gonna try to get some coffee and breakfast in us, and try to hit this Big Pine Lakes Trail hike. It should be like ten miles ish round trip. I'm so much more comfortable now talking to the camera. Yeah, like you're like not like... making eye contact with the camera. Yeah, you barely talked at all. I think. No. In, in the first couple of videos. I still barely talk at all. <laughs> yeah. We were going to the beach. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's so funny. I didn't know how to say that. You could tell. It was like Big Pine Lakes Trail. Like yeah. I was so lost. <laughs> what time did I say it was? It was like... Like 5.45. Yeah. I was pretty lost, man. Just going to probably try to get up to the second lake and have some lunch. Should be pretty awesome. Hopefully I am physically and mentally prepared for... Uh, the incline and the altitude and all that, but it should be all right. Okay, so I just <laughs> I just want to say something real fast. We did not train for this hike no. at all. No. I mentally prepared for it for months. Yeah. Like I ordered stuff like that I thought I'd need some gear. Uh, I got a pack that was way too big, mm -hmm. stuffed it with way too much stuff, way too much weight. I wasn't like exercising a lot or like practicing hikes. Like, yeah. We were doing like little hikes and I'm always doing outdoor stuff, but this is, this was a this 14 is a no mile, joke. like you, you get, I think it's a 3000 foot elevation gain. Like it's, you need to be, you need to be in decent shape. This to should do not this. be your first hike. No, ever. <laughs> we're kind of, we were kind of out of our minds. This yeah. is the hardest hike we've ever done. And for it to be like the first like video, yeah. um, was a little like biting off more than we could chew. Yeah. Um, I was worried about it. I mean, I was excited because like, I think when I think of things like this, that I get, it's like really, really hard. I just try to say like, okay, it's going to like, it's going to be so beautiful. It's like, if I never do it again, at least I could say I've done it. Like See, I just I'm try like, to use all mental. I'm like worst case scenario. Yeah. Like, so I'm thinking of like all kinds of stuff. Yeah. Like I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm gonna pull a muscle. Right. I'm gonna crack Which an ankle. Which is why your pack was 80 pounds. Yeah, cause I thought I would need all kinds of crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. um, which made it harder on me. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm always thinking of like, I don't know, and there's something about like going up into that altitude. Mm -hmm. um, just just turning up that road to the mountains. Like when you're right, driving through Bishop and you make a left and you start heading up into the Sierras and like, your ears start going yeah. your chest gets heavy and yeah. like if you start i start i get a, i get a little anxiety yeah getting um, up to this campsite is a is a pretty wild oh my ride. god how about that we're driving up i don't know if you remember this we're driving up this crazy mountain road to get up here and a bee 
flies through the window and smacks me straight in the face. Yeah. Right? You remember didn't that? I freaked out. Yeah. I don't know where that video is. I didn't I shoot some sort of iPhone you video. You had to. But holy shit, that was hilarious. But I was just I was just a little overwhelmed. Yeah. Like when you start approaching these mountains and you're driving higher and higher and higher, you feel like this mm -hmm. like you it really it's very humbling yeah your service goes you yeah. got no cell phone service you yeah. start to feel like really just disconnected yeah. which i love a little vulnerable though. vulnerable that's yeah. a good word yeah. yeah and like you know it's it's just us out there and, right. and we don't have any high-tech stuff like if you ever do like a hike like this and you start going where we're going in this video and stuff I really recommend that you get like um, a Garmin. Yeah, what are those things called? The Garmin like mini in reach. In reach, the Garmin in reach. Mm -hmm. We need one of those. Yeah. Um, I someone told me that it's like thirty five grand to get flown out of there in, oh, a, in a helicopter. I'm, I'm like sure. if you hurt yourself or yeah, something. I'm sure. It's crazy, but man, yeah, no. So I was a little worried. I was hiding it well, but uh, you were hiding it well. <laughs> yeah, but I was a little worried, you know, and um, yeah, I just. I've never done anything like this to up uh, up to this point. Mm, Have yeah. you? I mean, I I've gone on like hikes and things like that, yeah, but, but not, not, like, not this. like this ever. This was insane, and I and I feel bad because I don't think we did it justice because we didn't have the gear and the knowledge yeah. to like really show it. So yeah. I think it's good that we're gonna talk about it. I guess we'll uh, we'll check in later. So we're just starting out the Big Pine Lakes Trail. We're just at the trailhead now. We're gonna start heading up. And uh, see how it goes. So awkward. <laughs> pictures using using pictures. Aww. We're so new at this. I'm using pictures in the video, and I'm I'm using like the Ken Burns effect editing to make the move like video. All I got is an iPhone. Everything was just shot on my phone or yours too. Some some of yours too. Probably. That camp shot was shot on your your phone. Yeah. I remember that. My God. Aww. You gotta start somewhere, right? Yeah. We still got some pretty shots. Yeah. I always think of my friend Nick when I see that. Yeah. So to have the presence of mind to put the phone on the ground and get that shot, that's cool. Oh, this is funny. Oh. This is funny right here. All right, so look, we were supposed to take, if you can see that sign there, it's a South Fork straight and North Fork to the right. We were supposed to take the North Fork yeah. and we blew right by it. N neither of us saw it. Clearly, I don't I know walk, how we missed it. I walked right shot. by it. He's looking at me walk by it. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get a shot of her walking up here and technically we're supposed to bang her right there and yeah. then there's like, a, switchbacks. A few like, yes, yeah, staircase switchback looking things that yeah. get you up top. But instead, we walked straight all the way up this mountain and then there was like a driveway that went up yeah. and we came in contact with some people and stuff and we were trying to get on the right yeah. track and we were using the um, All Trails app yep. and we had the map of it, Yeah. Um, but we didn't have any service. So, <laughs> but this shot was so pretty because like I get you walking and then, and then it like pans over. Yeah. And this shot right here. Right there. That is what inspired the Where We Wild logo. Uh-huh. Um, we it, have it hanging in our dining yeah, room. Yeah, I took a, a real picture of that with a, a can, um, Nikon. Yeah. Nikon? Nikon? Nikon camera. And we have it framed in a, over our, by our dining room. But that, um, that inspired like the Everything. name of where we wild yeah. like we should even talk about that like what where we wild even means like some people i don't know if they really understand it yeah like sometimes when i say they're like oh really you got a youtube channel what's the name where we wild where we wild yeah yeah where we wild and like to us what, what that means is it's just like you know do you ever ask somebody like you know like where you know where they go on vacation where they where do you summer where do you go in the winter where do you live whatever so we figured where we wild is all the places where we do our outdoor wilderness type of stuff, yeah. whether it's, you know, Castaic Lake or like any place we go, mm -hmm. anything is, is just where we wild. Yeah. So I thought, I think it's a cool name. I love the name. Yeah. I, it kind of rolls off your tongue and like, I wonder like if people get it when they hear it. Yeah. 
Um, but yeah, that's what I, I kind of want to work on our logo like because we've had it from day one I know. And it's very very basic and I, I'd like to kind of just add to it a little bit Yeah, but that is also the banner picture oh. on YouTube, which I, I'd like to upgrade to but that inspired that view right there. Yeah uh, inspired Almost all of pretty our much. branding. Yeah, exactly. It's pretty crazy and it's it, really and cool. it should because it's uh, that, it was that breath, picture breathtaking does it zero justice. Yeah, too. I get another shot of it later. All right, so before we got to this point, bef sorry to keep pausing it. No. Before we got to that point up by that river there, we, we did a lot of work to get there. We didn't film any of that. Nothing. Oh my yeah, God. Yeah, we are so rookie, man. I feel so bad we, we didn't do this uh, justice at all. It's so hard to explain, but basically after- Should we rewind it? I don't even no, know how to, you can leave it, but like, how to get there. Like if, when you, you walk across this, that bridge there, you come to this area where we messed up and we went up that way and then you have to get back on that trail. Yeah. But then once you get there, I think I get a shot turning back and showing it at some point. Probably but, at the end. But there's a long way between there and that water. So from here to this water, we climbed up a mountain. Just up and over a, a just peak. To Crazy. Put it, put it completely simply, we climbed yeah. an entire mountain. Like once we got back on the trail, there was like a little sort of patch of like dense forest. Like, do you remember that part? It, it looked like kinda, this. It, it looked, looked like this, like but that, it was but like it was, it very, was there was like more trees, right? So then once you get through there, there's a clearing and you see this mountain in front of you and you keep following the trail and then you realize that the trail is going to lead you up and over the mountain through a series of switchbacks a lot that of switchbacks. never end when i first <laughs> laid eyes on the switchbacks and i and i saw where it was all heading i go we're going there yeah i turned to her and i'm like we're going up there yeah i had no idea um and it like, was probably like i don't even know it was Dude, 15 there was at least. long, long ones that first scooped up the side and got you level with that. Then you got up to the rock area right. where there was all stairs built out of rocks and switchbacks and they were working on it. The yeah. forest service yeah. was camped out up top of the lakes and they were coming down and they were working on that path yeah. and, and trail. Jesus, man. It I feel, I, I'm ashamed of myself. We did such a crazy thing well, here. We just gotta go back and do it again. And we didn't document, you know, half of it like you know it's going to say at some point like you know we really jumped ahead it's okay it's just crazy how much uh went into this and it's crazy to think about it's our first video yeah that water was so good though remember we got it with our water bottles yeah yeah okay here we go here we go that's what i was looking for yeah all right. So we climbed that. <laughs> yeah, so we started all the way down the bottom there. We worked our way in towards us, and you start wrapping up these um, switchbacks. Switchbacks, yeah. I, th was that water shot after this? Yeah. Was, oh, there's more water where we got the water from, right. I think. So we're getting close to, you know, getting to where you start climbing over the mountain here, but you can see that shot all the way down. I wonder if it's not good that we're using YouTube to watch this because like when you pause it, it kind of blocks some stuff out. That's okay. But that was a long way, That's man. A, a button. Oh, never mind. Can I rewind it? No. Yeah, it's so funny because it's, it's like kind of not chronological, but. Yeah, I, I kind of jumped around and yeah. stuff a little bit because I didn't have enough footage yeah. i guess that's a shame it's okay that's a shame that pisses me off now it's like we're like i, I take it so seriously yeah, not I now um and i'm just like always like trying to get different angles i got two cameras i, I want more cameras yeah we got the drone now i'm always complaining that we don't use that enough you know well we gotta we just gotta do this again yeah. <laughs> uh, it, by I'm, the way i've been trying so hard to get him to do this it was a hundred degrees hundred degrees <laughs> yeah, it was. outside a hundred degrees and you're going 14 miles my fat ass like seriously i was i'm was so out of shape i still am that's probably why my back freaked out um <clears throat> but man dude like this was really hard it, it really was i was dying we'll get to that point so here's where we got the water oh uh, yeah this is different 
Yeah, we used our little Sawyer straws. Yeah, so yeah, we have Sawyer mini filters and we dipped them in there with like a bandana to get the thick stuff out and then we filled big uh, smart, smart water. water bottles and then we kind of just put the filter on and we were drinking them through that. It was so good, it was so cold. Yeah, it was pretty cold. They got warm nice. fast though. Well, yeah. Really fast with the degrees. sun beating on it. But yeah. it was beautiful. It was beautiful. Yeah. But I remember this was right after we got over that main peak of yes. it. Yes. And then it kind of started to flatten out a little bit. Yeah. I was like, oh, thank God. Uh, but it was still really uh, a lot of people coming yeah. and going at this point. On the way back, we didn't see anybody. No, because it was. Yeah, that's crazy. We'll get there. Yeah. Do you remember that woman running? Running this where? woman that passed us we're, we're pausing it too much. was like right. literally Sorry. running. If you she, want to see this video without us interrupting every two seconds, it's our very first video yeah. hiking Big uh, big Pine Lakes Trail. But um, this is a director's commentary, so. Yeah. The, do you remember that woman? She was running. She ran up the, oh, yeah. the rock. She smelled. Well, what do you expect? You remember She's that? running. No, I know, but she had some serious BO going well, on, right? Not, yeah, but, but like, yeah, she was cranking. I don't. God bless. She God ran bless. all the way up that mountain that we had just huffed and puffed to get up, and then she continued running past us. And then I think she passed us again. God bless. Like she had done the entire loop. That's the whole thing about this trail is that there's seven lakes. We only yeah. made it to two. Two or three. Oh, maybe it was three. But still, we didn't get to all seven. I think seven is no, like no, no. 20 miles or something. You go all the way up to that like glacier, really. Yeah. Um, really. And so she had essentially done the entire loop and like ran the whole Do you ever thing. see people doing stuff like that and you're just like, how, how do you... want to stop them and ask them how why. How do you have your life this together? <laughs> like how, like what, how, how are you, well, you, you know, know what I mean? Like maybe just, everything else is a mess. Uh, maybe, maybe. Maybe she's just all like health and, and yeah. phys, uh, you know, being physical, uh, you know, being in shape, but yeah. geez, I look at people like that and I'm just like, how, how do you do that? It just made me laugh. I'm like we coughing were and like... coughing and dying. I wonder how, I think my pack weighed around 25, 30 pounds. It had to have. You packed so and much And I stuff. saw everybody with these tiny little bags yeah. on and I'm like, I'm an idiot. Yeah. I didn't even know what I was thinking. I was just... I told you for weeks, why are you doing it? I could I fit, his bag is so big, I could fit inside of it. And the weight of it was pulling down on my traps and... Yeah. Yeah, I messed up, man. I've never done anything like this. I just want to be prepared, you no, know? No, I know. I just didn't, uh, it was I mean, even, my first time. I mean, even my pack was pretty heavy. I just used that blue backpack that you guys see all the time. and But I yeah. I really packed it, too, so. Yeah, mine was just too big. It's all good. Five hours later. <laughs> yeah, we really skipped ahead here. Yeah. All right, so I hear, God, my hand's shaking. I'm so shocked. I hear we are close to finally getting up to the first lake. There's a sign. Lakes one through seven. I am dying. It's a, it is a serious, serious climb up, man. My traps are killing me and shoulders from my pack. Um, I, that's really the worst pain. But just, you know, uphill, 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 uphill. You know, you got to take a little couple breaks. I stopped a lot. You did. A lot. Um, we were and, on the, and it's fine. When we were on the switchbacks, man, like I was, I was stopping like every five minutes at yeah. one point. 96 to, 96 to 100 degrees. Yeah. I got 25, 30 pounds on me. Yeah. It was killing yeah. my trap. And the other thing is, I I got these hiking shoes, these Columbia mm, shoes yes. in, uh, before the boots I own now. They were low tops and my ankle kept turning. My ankle turned four or five times on this hike and I we had poles. I got so lucky, man. I don't know how I didn't, like sprain ankle. my ankle or yeah. something because it turned on me four or five times yeah and i kept going for some reason a few of them too i was like <gasps> like it. i didn't wear these those shoes ever again after this no i got home and i bought the high tops yeah. and i always have the ankle support now so if you do something like this god bless if you're into the low top sneakers oh, yeah. the trail running shoes ankle support man i think is huge because you you just hit one tiny little pebble and boom you it just yeah. Oh man, I got so lucky so many times. But so we got all the way up. We started at like 7,500 feet. Mm -hmm. We're now up to like 9,500. Mm -hmm. And you know, I don't know, five hours. So it took us five hours to get to this point. That's yeah. pretty much five hours from where we started the hike to now. 
What time do we start the hike in the morning? Like eight? Probably eight. Eight ish, right? Yeah. And uh yeah. So five hours, so now like one, two o'clock in the afternoon. That makes if sense. If we're accurate here. Yeah. Um so hundred degrees and um I'm dying, literally. Yeah. No man, I was hurting. I was hurting. My trap was numb. No. I think we're getting close. So I'm in some pain, but I'm alive. I'm trying to be funny. How, how are you? Doing good. My shoulders are on fire. Yeah, I can't move my trap. I need Mr. Miyagi. <laughs> Seriously. Mr. Miyagi. Oh, you feel it? That is yeah. bad. All right. I'm diving in this lake when I get there. I don't care how cold oh, it is. Oh, it's going to be amazing. I don't care. That's a lie. Because once I felt how cold it was, I was I didn't want to dive in. It was that cold. Oh, I went in. I, we went a little. No, I submerged myself. For a second, but I wanted to straight up swan dive into it yeah. and be like, ah, this yeah, water yeah. we we're gonna get to was just above freezing. It was probably well, forty to forty five degrees. I would say it's it, glacial melt. Oh yeah, no, it was cold. I I fully baptized myself. I, I mean, like, let's go. I dumped a little, but it was cold <laughs> when it hit my. Yeah. I was like, well, it's always the, when you're a guy, when cold water hits that area first, and then your heart. That's the two, your armpits and your... Your other pit? Yeah, your, uh, yeah, hits head number one, your, uh, you hit the roof, man. It's, it was bad. It was cold, but we're not quite there yet. Let's go. Still alive. <laughs> Jesus. And I thought we were close We're then. dying right now. Yeah, we were. But... How long was it when I, like, right then, I was like, we're close. The sign's here. Yeah. It's right around, it's got to be right around the corner. Yeah. It was another set of switchbacks, 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 switchbacks. It just kept going. What do you think? It was another half hour to an hour more? Uh, I'd say an hour. An hour more from that point. Yeah. And now we're up to 10,000 feet. Yeah. And we're at the first lake. Yep. Jesus. I was dying, man. It's the first lake. <laughs> It was but beautiful. Look at that. And that's on an iPhone. Yeah. Shaking. My arms are shaking. Oh, well, yeah. Pretty beautiful. Pretty beautiful. I'm itching already. Look at this. Look at this. Joke, There's a friggin' dead mosquito <laughs> on under what side? My right side? Yeah. yeah. Under my right jawline. There's a dead mosquito <laughs> stuck in my beard. Cause, and I'm itching all. Dude, these mosquitoes were getting me all over my face. I didn't have a mosquito net. I didn't have anything like that. They were getting me all over. At some point in this video coming up, you're going to see welts all over me. Yeah. I'll talk about it when I get there. But right now in this shot, if I can show it to you on the screen, you'll see a dead mosquito stuck in the hair right under my jawline. Do you remember that lady? Remember when we got in the beginning, when we didn't go on the trail we were supposed to go on and we ran into her and she was like in tears with how bad she got bit it was her and her son vaguely and we gave her the um oh yeah we, we gave, gave her, her the, the bug stuff. spray Jesus. she was like beside herself she was like i don't know what to do like these bugs are insane it was and it i was, was like this was july 22nd yeah yeah 2019 and i this video was posted on august 6th mm -hmm. so once we got back from the trip and i like put this stuff together so July up here, man, the mosquitoes are no joke. If you ever do this, bring, you know, you're not gonna walk around with lit sage, uh, but bring a mosquito net for your face, dude. Yeah. Bring a mosquito net for your face. It sucks when you're getting bit on your arms and your legs and stuff, but when you're getting it on your, your neck and your cheeks and your, yeah, your head. Yeah, that's tough. Geez, that's really tough. It, it's torture, it's torture. No joke though. Took us around five hours to get up here. We took a lot of breaks though, because uh, I don't think we were prepared <laughs> physically yet for something like. Look at the, the, look at the, the well on the side of my face. Yeah. We got here. We didn't give up. I did not. And so, yeah, it took five hours. So we didn't give up though. No, we didn't. I wanted to. Oh, I know. A couple times. I, was I know like, you did. Listen, man, I don't know. This is. I. It's like it's one of those feelings where you're just like, how much further is it? It, it becomes a mental game at that point. Yeah, but it's just the little things that chip away at you. The heat, the the weight of your pack, the, the, the your neck pain, your trap pain from it, the bugs smacking you in the face. Yeah. Like, it was just starting to build up, the, you know like, what I mean? The, breathlessness from all the switchbacks. How long the... is it taking? Like, knowing we got to go back. Yeah. We're not camping up here. We got to make it back yeah. before dark. Like, little things just That's start picking at your brain. That's what was messing you up. He kept stressing about 
getting back. How are we gonna get? How are we gonna get back? It's already so late yeah. in the day. Yeah, I'm watching the clock. Like Jesus, it's taken us so long to get up here. Yeah. And like that's the problem. It took us way too long to get up there. Yeah. Way too long. Like most people that are keep moving, you know, in shape, light packs, they get up there two or three hours, hours yeah. probably. But I, you know, it took us five because I took so many breaks. Listen, you were hurting too. Um, no, I'm laughing I, at both of us. We don't really have any footage of it. I, we really, I'm, I really wish we had kept, we just didn't have GoPros yet or anything. Yeah, and, right. and to have your phone on the whole time, I know. You, you're trying to save your battery. We didn't even have the battery packs yet, I don't think. We had the blue one. Oh, we did? We had one. But you know, you're trying to save your phone. I'm trying to shoot a video. I'm trying to do so much. And uh, it's just insane. What the hell is on my face? I got stuff all over me. <laughs> We're gonna, uh, I guess, hang out. We're gonna make it to the second lake, hang out for a bit. But then we gotta head back and go all the way back down, which I hope won't be as hard. But uh, I think we need to go enjoy the second lake. Yeah. Beautiful though. So we made it up to second lake. Look at this. Jesus Christ. I got a huge welt right here. <laughs> bit. A another one up here on the cheek. On the other side of the face, it's all all red. I I got hammered, man. Yeah. This is bad. I didn't get them so bad. Look at look at my face. Yeah. It took a long time, man. We had to take a lot of breaks. But that's our pretty beautiful. I mean, look, it is beautiful, like, but Jesus, look at my face. Yeah, I know, it's bad. That is so bad, dude. Oh my God. So we got up to there, right? We got up to that lake. We made crappy food. Uh, it was like those uh, side dishes, hamburger helper type things. What, oh, what was God. that? Oh God. Um, didn't we make the like sides, Spanish those, those, rice? Those green bags that are just called like sides or uh -huh. whatever. And we just boiled water. We didn't have mountain house meals or anything like that. And it was kind of gross. And like, I look, I do have my fishing pole on me. I wanted to fish that lake. I wanted to hang out, relax. There was some people camping, you know, some dogs running around, stuff like that. It was like real steep to get down into that. And so we kind of just ate food for a couple minutes and, and plunged in that water for a second, ice cold. Yeah. Um, it felt great on your feet because um, oh. your feet get so swollen after all that hiking. Yeah. But my God, dude, I was freaking out. My face was on fire from all the mosquitoes. Um, and like, I am the type that obviously welts and swells up when I get nailed, man. It was bad, but so instead of, it took us so long to get up there that we didn't even really get to enjoy that lake. We, we kind of like had to rush through it because I knew we had to get all the way back down five hours thinking, you know, five, six hours yeah. and it's going to get dark. Yeah. And, you know, it turned out that it was good that we left when we did because we barely got out of there by dark and then it started to rain. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's a shame. Like it was our first time doing it. So, yeah. but yeah, that was, that was crazy, man. And we spent like an hour at the lake. Wish we could have spent more time, but we got to get back before dark. We baptized ourselves. So yeah, we plunged in there. If I had a GoPro, I would have shown you, but. <laughs> All right, well, hopefully we get back safe. Yeah, we will. All right, let's go. It was beautiful though. Pictures. <laughs> yeah, that's all I got. And so right there at that area, that's where that peak is Yeah. that, that you have to get up and over. And I took a shot right here and we had to make it all the way back down through that valley, wrapping around through there. And as we started walking down there, um, it started to rain. It started to get real dark and we were the only ones. Yeah. It was on like the trail. everybody else everyone, yeah. knew. <laughs> well, no, every, everyone that had got in for the day had got out already yeah and everyone that had got into camp was not coming back out for right. the night so we were one of the only few people trying to squeeze it all in yeah like and, and get there and back which was actually kind of nice because i don't know how i would have felt coming down that mountain with up so many people behind us and feeling rushed to like get down yeah no but listen you know when you're I mean? doing a hike like that you you let people go you let people pass you yeah well, no, you, I know. you know everybody works together you yeah. know you take your time you're polite you help people but yeah man that it was uh there's a you know the rainbow 
It was beautiful. It was beautiful. New adventures coming soon. More adventures. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have been new. Subscribe. Yeah, that's it, man. It's only a seven minute video, but there was so much that we didn't show. It's a, it's a shame. I know. It's actually crazy. I don't know why I thought it's we didn't have the gear yeah but my god like we we didn't even do that justice at all no there was didn't. so much to that hike man like it's it's a hard hike i believe i posted the what my health app looked like the day after we did that oh yeah yeah so walking and running distance july 22nd 14.1 miles steps thirty thousand five hundred and twenty eight. Flights climbed 86 floors. Mm -hmm. So, there you see that. So that was it. That was the hike. And it took us around 10 hours, mm -hmm. uh, which is embarrassing. Really. Wow. But, Listen, if we... When was this? 2019? Yeah. So August, we, we moved uh, to July, Cal July 22nd, 2019. Yeah. So we moved to California in 2017. Yeah. This was the start of like our real sort of adventure outdoor yeah like, like i've been crazy yeah, things i've been like, fishing my whole life no of course fishing and like doing like camping and outdoorsy stuff but, but it's growing like up on the east coast you don't see shit like they, that they don't make mountains no, like that you don't i've never seen anything like that no ever so for us to do something like that that's so strenuous and like i'm sure on all trails it says it's like an advanced hike right? like, it says like, hard it probably says hard yeah um and to do it within a day but without getting super hurt, just really sore. Like, I'm really proud of us. Uh, we've never done something like that. Yeah, no, I, I'm proud of us. I'm ashamed that that's the video I made for it. <laughs> well, I mean. It was our first video, man. Yeah. But I just wish I had more gear. Yeah, it's just and hard. And it's part of the John Muir wilderness. Like, come on. Enjoy this 15.2 mile. Well, we only have like a mile left to go. We should have just kept going. Enjoy this 15.2 mile out and back trail near Big Pine, California, generally considered a challenging route. It takes an average of seven hours and 47 minutes to complete, but we didn't go all the way, so. But still. This is a very popular area for backpacking, camping, You'll likely encounter other people while exploring. The best times to visit this trail are May through October. Dogs are welcome and may be off leash in some areas. 15.2 miles, elevation gain 3,982 feet, out and back. So, you know, I mean, if you're not prepared for something like that, like if you're gonna go and do that, like- Train for like at least three months. Yeah, go on some like easy hikes and put some weight in your pack, like mm -hmm. rocks or water bottles. That'd be perfect. Mm -hmm. Get your whatever pack you're planning on using your your backpack. Fill it up with water bottles. Make it heavier than what you're gonna take out there. Is my advice. Mm -hmm. And you know, break in the shoes, the right shoes you're gonna use, the poles you're gonna use. You everything. Don't go up there with anything brand new. Which that's, is what we did. That's stupid. We and were that's basically pulling tags everything. Off brand stuff. new, <laughs> brand new shoes, pretty much. Mm -hmm. That pack was brand new. Everything was, we bought like all new stuff for that trip because listen, yeah. like I said earlier, we were road tripping. That was, that was at the start of a, of a long road trip. We, yeah. we went to one place before that, but then we road tripped all the way up to Redwoods mm -hmm. and we wanted to go even further, but we just ran out of gas because this was so friggin' draining. Yeah. And we started the whole road trip out like that. It was, uh, it was just insane, man. So that's it, man. Hiking Big Pine Lakes, our first video ever. Um, if you enjoyed this uh, kind of director's commentary style video, let us know in the comments if you want us to do it to any of our other videos, um, any ones in particular that you'd want more information about or like to hear some more behind the scenes stuff about. I think we're going to maybe try to do this. I I'd like to kind of do this to like my favorite videos that yeah. we've done like yeah. every once in a while, just kind of sprinkle it in like a director's commentary. Yeah. It's kind of cool. Just to like go back and relive, you know, everything, you know, and, and that's what's awesome about making these videos too, is that you can go back and relive all this cool stuff, you know? know. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop a like, and if you're into this sort of thing, don't forget to hit subscribe. We put a new video out every week, and hopefully next week, my back won't hurt so much, and I can go outside <laughs> and not be grounded. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Later.
want to see more videos just like this one, be sure to check out the rest of the Where We Wild YouTube channel, where we post a brand new video every week. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you get notified whenever we post a new adventure. Thanks for watching.